Welcome back to part three of my paranormal series. Today, I will share a personal experience that happened in my childhood home. So let's take it back to 2007. I was like 14 years old and it was summer break. And me and my friends from the neighborhood always used to hang out all day long, playing football outside, basketball, playing Xbox. And the neighborhood is mostly family. And everyone seems like a family. So you can leave your doors unlocked and not be too worried about that. But from my instance, we had dogs at the time. So my house was always protected. So it was a regular day and I decided to meet up with my friends. And when I left out the house to walk down the street, I purposely left the door wide open. Now the door, it was two doors. You had a main door and a screen door. So I left the main door open, but the screen door was shut. Again, I felt comfortable doing that because I felt like my dogs at the time were my personal alarm system. So if anyone unfamiliar came in the yard, they would be barking out of control. And, you know, I would run back to the house and see what was going on. So as I'm walking down the driveway, which is a big driveway for my yard, I look back at my house out of curiosity and I look at the door and the door slowly shut by itself. Now, both of my parents are at work and no one is in the house. And something just told me in my mind to look back at that door. And when I seen it shut, I was in disbelief. I tried to ignore it and I was like, maybe it was the wind or something like that. But come on, man, in South Carolina, it wasn't no wind blowing in June or July. So, um, yeah, I was in disbelief and I was scared as hell, <laughs> just to be honest. So I went on about my day as usual, playing around, playing football or whatever. However, later that night, something really paranormal happened and I was half asleep in my bed and I'm one of those people who sleep with the TV on. But on this particular night, I woke up out of my sleep and the TV was on static. It was like the poltergeist. <laughs> the TV was just, you know, static and out of control. Next thing you know, the TV turned by itself and it turned to a Christian channel and a preacher was preaching. I forget the sermon or whatever he was talking about, but that experience was like none other. Till this day, I don't know what exactly was watching me or what was playing with me that day, but I'm getting goosebumps just talking about it because it's bringing me back to that time. And anything that can muster up enough power to physically turn the TV and turn it to a specific channel that I never watched, I was like what in the world something was definitely watching over me i don't know whether it was a family member um referring back to the door shutting but i don't know if they were shutting the door just to say hey shut the door lock the door um and i don't know man it was it was a great experience but at the same time it was like whoa <laughs> what's in this house with me but yeah, that was my paranormal experience I wanted to share with you all. And let me know down in the comment section, have you ever had anything paranormal happen to you? And also share down below on what you guys think about my personal paranormal experience that happened to me. I'm curious to see what you guys think. So yeah guys, make sure you subscribe for more paranormal content. Be safe. Peace.